Hey guys, so today I'm going to be making another food video and today we're going to be making um Alfredo with homemade Alfredo sauce. So that's what we're going to be doing today. I know I've been going for a minute, but just how it go. But we back with another video. We back with another food video. I'm going to start making other videos, but like I've been cooking a lot lately, so I'm going to just start recording it. But yeah. But we're going to get right into okay, it. Okay, so right here I had already prepared the noodles. So I'm just showing y'all. And um, always wash your chicken before you do this part. Like, I already had washed my chicken and did all of that before I cut it. And then I did it after. But you're going to see once the video keeps going. I dice my chicken up in medium like sizes because once you fry them, they're going to shrink. And this is showing y'all like how dirty the chicken was I, even after I diced them up because I washed it before and after I diced it. And um, I tried my best showing y'all the seasoning that the seasonings that I use, but you can literally see the seasoning. And then once you get in the store, you're going to know right after jump which one it, which one it is. But um, I pour both of the side zone, whatever you call it. Um, I pour both of it on the chicken then for the garlic seasoning as you can see i only did a little bit of it because you don't want to over season your chicken like see for all the other seasonings i don't i didn't do too and much and then right here i'm just going in with the bowl i like but, doing the bowl better i noticed that i really like doing the bowl better as in putting a chicken inside of the bowl seasoning in the bowl and like mixing it together with my hands because it makes it so much more like I don't know like it made the seasonings really like touch for real and then i put some oil inside of the pan and just put the um chicken inside wait for it to cook you could i was going to use butter you could use butter too but i didn't i just used the um oil I just love, 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 like, garlic. Like, I don't know. Like, the garlic really gives it an extra touch. Make sure that if you is, like, making this, make sure that you get that garlic. Because, oh, that garlic is the best to use. Like, it really gives it the touches. That right here, we just taking the shells off of the shrimp because we're going to be putting this out of the bowl. And um, I let my little brother do that part. I also forgot to mention that I only use those noodles because for some reason, I'm the type that like, I like everything just right, like how it's supposed to be. Alfredo really not supposed to be used with spaghetti noodles, but I didn't even know what I was going to make. When I had, uh, when I did the noodles, I didn't even know what I was making. But I'm like, I already got the chicken and I wanted to always make that sauce. So I might as well just try it out. right here i didn't actually film the part where i poured the heavy whipped inside but i put heavy whipped and then put the, the same seasonings and stuff that i use for the chicken and then um i put some cheese inside as you can see and just let it sit until i got that like that thickish texture like how the original like alfredo sauce comes out of the bottle like we need that texture so right here i got done with the alfredo sauce i'm just pouring it on the bowl i also made another batch of the alfredo sauce to i mean of the alfredo and alfredo sauce but um this is how it looked after it was so good like y'all it was so good y'all need to try this for real this was my batch of the homemade alfredo sauce it was so good after this, I had just made me a small bowl of it, and I just put it all in a container like this, and that was it. So, yeah, y'all should try this out. It was so good. I love this so much. And make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.